for a trip down Orwellian Nightmare Lane. Except it's not a nightmare, and it's all very real. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thanks to all of the witnesses for being here. Uh, before, uh, I, I want to visit with you, Ms. Metzke, but before I do, I just want to clear one thing up. Professor Bridges, you said several times, you've used a phrase, I want to make sure I understand what you mean by it. You've referred to people with a capacity for pregnancy. It, would that be women? Three, two, one. Many women, cis women, have the capacity for pregnancy. Many cis women do not have the capacity for pregnancy. Um, there are also trans men who are capable of pregnancy, as well as non-binary people who are capable of pregnancy. No, no. You need a uterus, ovaries, and a womb in order to get pregnant. Men don't have that. So this isn't really a women's rights issue. It's a, it's, we can it's recognize a that this impacts women while also recognizing that it impacts other groups. Those things are not mutually exclusive, Senator Hawley. Oh, my God. The oozing, festering, completely undeserved arrogance and condescension from a person who's about to deny all established biological scientific fact. Oh, so your view is, is that the core of this, this right then is about what? So um, I want to recognize that your line of questioning um, is transphobic, um, and it opens up trans people to violence by not recognizing that. Wow, you're saying that I'm opening up people to violence by asking whether or not women are the folks who can have pregnancies? So I'm one, I want to note that one out of five transgender uh, persons have attempted suicide. So I think it's important Because of my us. line of questioning? Because so we can't talk about it? Because denying that trans people exist and pretending not to know that they exist I'm is denying dangerous. that trans people exist by asking are you? you if you're talking are you? about women are you? having pregnancies. Do you believe that uh, men can get pregnant? Excuse me. What? No, I don't think women can get <laughs> So you pregnant. are denying that trans people exist? Thank and that leads to violence? You either agree with her objectively false premise or she's going to make you feel pain. Oh my God. Stop it, or I will turn this on and leave you in agony all night. There are four lights. <laughs> there are five lights. How many do you see now? Do you believe that uh, men can get pregnant? No, I don't think <laughs> So you are denying that trans people like this thing. And that leads to violence? In this case, she's trying to ostracize Josh Hawley from society by assigning labels to him that would put him in what the communists call the black class. Is this how you run your classroom? Are students allowed to question you? Absolutely. Or are they also treated like this? Where no, you, no, no, they're, they're told that to they're question. opening up people to oh, violence. We have a good time in my class. You should join. Oh, I bet. You might learn a lot. Wow, I, I would learn a lot. I've learned a lot just from this exchange. Absolutely. Extraordinary. All right, folks, I've damaged my brain just enough to call it a day. If you enjoyed, please smack that like button, subscribe, share, and leave a comment to let us all know what you think. Thanks a lot. See you on the next one.